But I think it's very important that we do uh, highlight how important International Women's Day is, um, because although the suffragettes did a fantastic amount of work, I think if they came back today, they'd say, hang on girls, you're not done quite enough. And I think we need to look back and see what they did and see how we can help the young, young women in the future. As a sportswoman, I'm always looking for inspiration, inspiring things, and sharing my practice with others as well. Give some sort of context about um, the university, about where you're sitting now. So we've got more female professors now than ever before. Um, as I said, we've got a female VC. We've got a female chair of our board of governors. Half of our board of governors, actually just over half, are female. But I need you all to greet people who are around the room. So off you go. Because 50% of the population are women. But the Chinese say that if half the population sit down, then the sky will fall in. Creativity is the birthplace of connection and innovation. Uh, and when I joined policing, I was given a handbag, a pair of handcuffs that went on front of the handbag, and a little truncheon like that. The men were given a massive truncheon like that, with all of this stuff around them, and yet I was dealing with exactly the same thing. Only the fearless can be great. So I came this evening just to see what the event was about. I knew obviously it was International Women's Day, and we've run events ourselves in the Front Theatre over the last week, but I did think actually the event was excellent. Walked in, and the only guy in the room was a bit disconcerting, but I thought it was a great evening. A very, very big mixed bag of, of ladies in the room.